My name is Dr. James Kent, and I'm a lecturer in Hispanic Studies. I'm also a practicing photographer. From the first time I visited Cuba at 18 years of age, I always said that I would return to the country in the event of the death of Fidel Castro. When Fidel died in November 2016, I flew straight up to the country to photograph the island and its people in the wake of his death. As I travelled the length of the country from Havana to Santiago de Cuba, I was really struck by not only the different people that lined the streets, but also the different images that they were holding in their hands. Placards, banners, posters, images of Fidel Castro that ranged from Castro as a very young man to images of him when he was very elderly. When I returned to Royal Holloway, I used the photographs as part of a case study on my second year course, Rebels, Revolution and Representation in Latin America. What was really interesting with this case study was to look at the photographs and to discuss them with the students from the point of view as a practitioner, from the photographer, as in the person who created them. And we therefore were able to compare my representation of the revolutionary movement with those uh, the, those revolutionary moments represented by other photographers, photogenics. 